Leon's a professional baby. No, oh, okay. Don't, don't try that with another baby. <laughs> because today we got our very first baby item. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And we kind of already opened it a tiny bit. And it's so nice, guys. It's so, so nice. You're probably wondering what the heck it is, so let me show you. We got this. It's a stroller. It was sent to us from the company Mom Push. I'll leave a link in the description below if you guys are interested. And right now we're getting ready to open it. You're excited too. I saw a smile. <laughs> oh my gosh. And guys, look at how beautiful it is. It is gorgeous. What's that? The bassinet? Yep. Ooh, that's big. Let me see. Ooh, that's nice. Oh, it's so soft. Now this is a breathable bassinet, so it's sleep safe, John. It's sleep safe. You're going to help test out the stroller, right? It's for your baby brother or sister, but you can be our tester. Okay, honestly, you'll probably use it until your baby brother or sister arrives because it is so nice. This is the stroller frame. It all comes separate. The frame, the seat, and the bassinet. And that is because you can switch positions, guys. Literally, I'm so excited. Um, Leon stroller, I thought it was super nice, but it wasn't like we bought it brand new or anything. It was donated to us. Greatly appreciated. But having like a brand new stroller that literally switches positions and has a bassinet and everything, I'm just like so excited. Like I've never had anything like this. Leon's had a lot of nice things, but I'm talking about like the stroller, like oh, so excited. Oh my gosh, look at this wheel, how big it is. You know what? I wonder if it'll go good on like sand at the beach because the wheels are so big. Cause Leon's stroller, let me tell you what, it struggles on the beach. But look at this thing. That's so like huge. I don't know, we'll have to test it out. Okay, these are not air-filled tires. They are like plasticky foam tires, which I actually prefer because I feel like the air-filled tires sometimes deflate and that is not what you want. So, let's open this frame, John, will you help me? Oh, he's like putting together the bassinet. <laughs> he can't wait either. <laughs> it's really nice. I feel that it's secure enough. Not I mean, like sitting there, but yeah. <laughs> You're I mean, like, you have it on a super tiny little ledge. It's secure. <laughs> when the bow breaks, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that beauty. We got it all put together. It's absolutely gorgeous. Look at how beautiful it is. It has the leather bar for the parents and it feels super nice, guys. It's really good quality. And it has a leather bar for the child. Now you can just press a little button right here and release it and it's a swivel. All directions, you can just set it there, put your kid in, you wanna put Leon in it? And it has a five point harness. And then you can just take the little belly bar and put it back over here like that. Now Leon is four years old, he weighs 30 pounds and he is 38 inches tall. So he's definitely a little tall, but he's well within the weight range of 50 pounds. And as you can see, like his feet are pretty comfortable. <laughs> what are you doing under there? <laughs> and this has a lot of selections. This is all the way back. One, two, three, four, okay, four. But then guys, it unzips right here and gives you even more. So you've got five, just five. Okay, so there's five selections. This part back here is mesh for lots of breathability and we live in Florida, so definitely need that. And there's also an extra peekaboo window. So how cool. Now this isn't like Velcroed or magnetized, it just like sits there, but it seems like it's pretty secure, so. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> So I super like it, I think that that's nice. It doesn't go back all the way though, I've noticed. So that's a little strange. What do you think? You like it? <laughs> Something that I super like about the footrest is this is like a wipeable material where their shoes would go. So I thought that was pretty cool. Oh, show them how the footrest adjusts too. That's pretty cool, look. It goes all the way up. Yeah. And then it goes 
all the way back. So yeah. if, like Leon's taller, his feet, I mean, he fits in, you know? Yeah, he does. But like if he was a little too tall, you could just put this down. And then he could use this part as a headrest. Yeah, it's super nice. And the seat does recline. There's a little button right here, and you can just whoop. <laughs> and I think it's almost a full. Oh, it is a full. It's a full recline. Look at that. You could take a nappy. What do you think? How cool. He's, he's like, on for dear life. He's like, what are you doing to me? <laughs> and guys, if you notice, it's facing the parent. Just wait, John, until I show you this. So you're supposed to take your child out of the seat, but uh, <laughs> you know, it also faces forward and it's super easy. You can see the side right there. It just literally clicks in and drop. What do you think, buddy? He yeah. likes it. He's smiling. Leon's a professional baby. Oh, okay. Don't, don't try that with another baby. <laughs> <laughs> I said you're not supposed to do that. What do you think? Look, he's holding on to the little bar. Oh, and it does have, for you tall parents, a super extendable arm. Me and John are definitely in that tall parents category, so that is super nice. Now, something that I noticed is it doesn't have, like, a parent tray, but there's plenty of room here to buy, like, one of those universal organizers, so I'm not really worried about that. Do you hear him giggling? Yeah. <laughs> I like these big tires on it. I know, that's what I said. I feel like they'd go great on the beach. And the shocks. Oh yeah, it has shocks. Look at that. So you have like tons of space here to put your diaper bag in. Will you grab my purse so I can show them? This is like a pretty big purse as you can see. And it fits like super easily in the basket. And look, you could probably fit two of them in there. And you could access it from the front as well. So that is super cool. But as a bonus, bam, look at that. So this is like the little parent spot and this is the kid spot and my purse fits in here. Super, super cool. And it's magnetized. So you just whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> I just love magnets. I think they're so cool. Show them the brake, how the brake works. Cause it's like one foot. Look at that flip flop barefoot friendly. Super, super cool. Guys, I'm so excited. I love this stroller. Something else I forgot to show you is that it comes with a foot muff. Now, we live in Florida, so I highly doubt we'll use it. Never but gonna use it. Look at that. And these things are expensive. So there you go for the winter time. Bam. So cool. And the bassinet just hooks on right where the stroller was. Super simple. And it can face either direction as well. It also has this little canopy thing and it has a peekaboo window and it has one, two, three, four positions. And this is the same belly bar so it like swivels out as well. Does this zip off, John? It does. Okay, so like in the summertime or whatever, you could take this off. Yeah, it comes all the way off. It buttons in. Okay. And then the buttons are right here. And then on the outside, there's just a little zipper on the other side, <laughs> right here. And it just zips right off. Okay, that's easy enough. Okay, cool. And the inside is nice and soft and cushy. Now, it is breathable, right? It is breathable, but it's warm. Yeah, it's hot. There's no ventilation like inside. I mean, it's breathable, but there's not like mesh or anything like that. So it is a warm bassinet, but I feel like if you open it all the way, it would be fine. Yeah. So I looked over, man, and Jody was being so weird. I'm not weird. Do it again, what she was doing. Like, what are you doing? Checking for breathability. It's not a gas mask. <laughs> so like, it is mesh, and the sides are mesh as well, but you never know, right? Oh. So the best way to check is just to suffocate yourself in it. <laughs> and I can breathe super easy. She like, was just like sitting over there doing it. I was like, what I was is like wrong with her? I it in my face. I checked the side too and you can breathe right through it. Weirdo. Do it. You do it. See, You'll see what I'm talking about. You gotta like shove it in your face. You can breathe right through it, right? Yeah. It's easier to breathe through than a mask, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Those masks are hot. Uh, yeah. So the breathability is checked out, guys. Even on the sides here. It is mesh, it's breathable. Now I'm not a fan of the fold. 
I think it might be because it's new so we have to kind of like break it in because everything's a little bit stiff but I could tell with use it will like loosen up some but you have to take this seat off to fold it and I don't really like that now we did fold it with the seat on and it folded but it wasn't like the best so I would not recommend it yeah and you never know like with all this leather if you're gonna tear something up doing yeah it. so you have to put the handle down this pulls freely yeah but you have to press the button to get this one to fold. And that folds the bar down. And then there's a little handle. Yep, right there. And it's folded. Now to unfold it, it's a little bit simpler. There's only like one step. You don't have to pull the handle or anything. You just press those buttons and pull it out. Yeah. There you go. And then put your seat back on. So it's, it's not bad. I just don't like the fact that you have to remove the seat. Something I almost forgot to show you guys is that the straps to the seat are adjustable. Guys, something I just noticed for like older kids, you can take the harness up here off and just have the three point belly harness. So that's nice. But Leon's really tall and it literally, he still has room. So I'm just gonna leave it on there. So I absolutely love it. I think it's gorgeous. It's really good quality. Like I've never heard of this brand Mom Push before, so I like wasn't sure if it was gonna be great quality or not. But it is. It's like really, really good quality. Um, the only two things that I can find wrong with it is, like I said, the fold. It's not a bad fold. It's actually easier now that we've done it a few times. I just don't like removing the seat. I don't like that. But all the new ones are like that. Yeah. Nuna Pippa, mm -hmm. everybody. You have to take the Nuna Pippa seat yep. out. I feel like that's a super common thing now. Um, they do not have car seat adapters yet, but they are trying to make some universal car seat adapters for it. Um, and the other thing that I don't really like, but is not an issue at all because it's going to go away, is the stiffness of everything. But already from like using the canopy a couple times, it's easier to push. So it's just because it's new. There's nothing actually wrong with the stroller. It's just new. You know how new stuff is. So literally my only like personal preference complaint is the the fold but like john said that's like a thing that everybody's doing now so it's not even an issue so pretty much like it gets an a plus 100 percent love this stroller and it's so beautiful i cannot get over how beautiful it is do you like it oh i like the way it looks i like the way the leather feels yeah. i like it the aluminum on mm -hmm. it it's really nice. I'm glad that, you know, they sent us the silver one. Yeah. It's not heavy either. I mean, it's it's a stroller. It's stroller heavy, but it's not like... Not, not like his... Um, his like, his Kiko, Chico, however you say it. That one's heavier. Yeah, that's heavy. That yeah. Chico one? Oh, my gosh. Yeah, so this one is a lot nicer. Um, Do you want to take it outside and test drive it? Different terrains and stuff? You see what it is? Yeah. Somebody sent her a gift, and now we got to go outside and walk around in a hot desert sun. I'm super excited! It's our first baby item. Let's go. Let's do it. All right. So Jody went to lay down, so I guess that's the end of our video. Let's start with our birthday shout out. So happy birthday to Brielle and happy birthday to Sahar. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful birthday. So that's it for today. Thank you again so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. We'll see you tomorrow in our next video. Bye.